Everyone always told me I never amount to much. Everyone said my mama and Tom. Tom Dexter's his name. I seen his tombstone. Now he believed in me. Tom always believed in me. Okay. Then he died. Then I had nothing. Nothing but his memories inside my brain. Along with all the worms? And the yard. Of course I had the yard and my dogs. And my projects. I always got my projects. Those fuckers back in town. They'll be howling a different tune when they watch me right out of here. Waving my handkerchief. Blowing exhaust up their tight assholes. Fuck you! They're gonna be sorry for treating me the way they did. Calling me a retire. And bad mouthing my mama. I bless her so. They're gonna pay for what happened to Tom Dexter. I'll tell you that too. I swear on my life. They'll pay. I swear on my life. Those are not good things to say. It's it's Scrapyard Edgar. He doesn't have much good to say. I got a list for my bus. It's a short list for a short bus. <laughs> Damn, I'm funny. Okay, I got, got that's a full size bus. bus. They're my dogs. Norma. I mean, Mrs. Creed. She's on there. Andy. If he asks nicely with politeness. The widow Franklin. <laughs> she's welcome to have a seat. Yeah, the engine fella, Red. Yeah, maybe him too. And the rest of them? Engine devil fella. worshippers, whores, lies, and cheaters. They can watch the rest of us roll out of here. Over the bridge and through the fog. They can rot in here until the day of judgment. Until the day exodus. Okay. Scrapyard Edgar is much less cool than I thought. How many times... Okay, that's another Exodus mention. It does keep coming up a lot. Okay, guys, what are you doing out here? Why are you so insistent on attacking me? Debbie, what part of kill all humans do you not understand? Am I human? Anymore? You're within, like, reasonable tolerances. That's not a good way to put it. Look, if, if you don't need, like, you know, silly makeup to depict you on Star Trek, you're, you're basically human. Deb? Yes? Is there something in that toilet? There is something in that toilet, trying to escape. Do you think... Maybe it's this... I mean... Go ahead. It could be anything. I mean, we're literally being invaded by... Sticky black ooze that someone might have tried to flush that. But it's not like. It's not connected to anything. How could they flush it? But this is a magical world. Could... I'm opening it. Don't... Don't look in strange toilets you find in the junkyard. Oh shit! Oh, it's, it's one of those. How did that thing get stopped by a toilet lid? I don't know. Oh god, this thing's just a zombie beacon. Another like one that of that asshole. Another one of those. Wait, what asshole? The guy in the bear trap. Oh yeah, that guy. I had forgotten all yeah, about- Yeah, I think he was the same guy who, um... I mean, I saw like three guys dressed all like him. In the- in the sheriff station, so maybe it's... It must be a popular fashion in the area, but no, I'm pretty sure it's the same guy. Maybe they all came from the same, like, bowling team. Also, somebody's put some traps out here. I better find out who did that while I'm at this. Oh, come on, drone! Can you not walk into the thunder into the golem? Look at that one, though. It looks like the juggernaut. Uh, we've already fought these before. Yeah, but I hadn't seen them in, like, decent lighting. There's mud with bits stuck in them. I can almost understand, like, the scrap ones. It's just the mud ones, isn't it? 
that's how golems were originally made. It oh god damn it. But no, golems were originally made of clay. That's what the Oh yeah, I know, but like you had to like sculpt the clay. Oh, you're not gonna get me there, buddy. Who keeps leaving all these bear traps? So... Yeah, let's see. Kind of a safety hazard. I mean, at least, at least, at least Danny had his all clustered in one place. Mm -hmm. Ten bucks as it was Edgar. Oh, I just brought that back to them. How nice of me. Oh, we've lo we're looking at the schematics of an advanced model Roti Recon drone. Their tech is very high end, but notoriously unreliable. My Nazi player skips like you wouldn't believe. Even though it's an Orochi recon drone, it's safe to say this isn't a simple recon mission. With Orochi, it's never just recon. Fun fact, Orochi is the biggest conglomerate empire in the world. They own Vali, Cycoil, Zagan, Manticore, Anansi, Fosh, QBL, and Plethron. They made everything you're wearing and everything you ate today. That's very discomforting. <sighs> no ethical consumption under capitalism. There is not. Hmm. Hey, this is a scenic flights place. Or no, this one isn't. But, like, somewhere in this general airport vicinity. There, there we go. There it is. Might as well pick this up while I'm here. Right, let's see what Beaumont left here. Mr. Beaumont... Unusually rude client had a circling the savage coast for ages, back and forth like he was looking for something specific, refused to pay extra fee. Wow, I mean, he's not just an eel sorcerer, but he doesn't tip. Seriously. Lovely girl from Finland, rather nice and clear. Small extra leap over Blue Mountain. Hmm. Wonder if that was. I wonder if that. You know, I don't know. I just have a weird hunch that might have been Cassandra putting on an act. It might have been, and so I'm just picturing, like, the scene at the end of at the end of Trading Places. I've right. never seen that movie. It's really good. It's got like Dan Aykroyd, Eddie Murphy, Jamie Lee Curtis. There. Okay, that is. Well, okay, wait. One more thing. There's nothing after this. That means that the fog came in sometime around this time. Well, maybe. I mean, if he's only doing one of these every two days, he probably doesn't get a lot of business. True, but still, I think it's safe to say that, you know, we're looking at like a mid-October for the uh, yeah, fog, right? Yeah, yeah. Beaumont, that name is triggering enough alarms to give Cassini an aneurysm. We have him pegged in Kingsmouth on several occasions. First, oh, this is interesting, in the 1600s. The dawn of the Silver Age of the Illuminati. The heart of our North American debut. Color me intrigued. Our target appears to have access to some pretty potent magic, including the magical sword. Quite possibly immortal, probably in charge of an undead army. Maybe it controlled the deadly, deadly fog. You'll want to get more comfortable with your own powers before you ch chase this one down. Don't get me wrong, we're very interested, keep up the good work, sport, etc. But we don't want to see you dead for reals. We're not- you're not actually immortal, just hard-headed and thick-skinned, blessed by fucking honeybees. You're not a god, not even a second-string deity, so pace yourself. You'll know when you're ready for the next step. Fuck it, I'll just tell you when you're ready for the next step, okay? Wow, she's telling me to hold back. That's not like her to show that kind of concern. Ashes? Oh. But I'm not Catholic. Trust me, it, it helps. Every little bit of symbolism you can find helps. Ah, sure. 
As long as killing Nazis is involved? No. Oh, worship a side of bacon. <laughs> <laughs> it kept getting worse. Yeah. Okay, so let's try to find out what's going on with these traps. Got some stuff to do. Oh! Oh, hey! Well. There's the fire truck. That's one mystery solved. Okay, so. There's the fire. Still burning. Gotta love that jet fuel. Well, I mean, you saw what happened to the truck. Well, I mean, like, it's been some time. It's weird for it to still be burning, but then again... Uh. I don't know how weird that... I don't know how weird it is, or how... Like... Or if it would still be burning normally. Yes. Yeah. But there... Would there normally be, like, a big storm drain in the middle of the runways? That seems kind of unsafe. Oh, no, yeah, this is normal. Really? Yeah. I don't think I've seen it. Well, I mean, like, otherwise it floods. That's why the storm drain's there. Well, I mean, I guess, but, like, it's... It seems like a hazard for an, air, for an airplane. I don't know. We're not supposed to land there. That's why there's lights. Well, I know that I know they're not supposed to, but you know, shit happens. Okay, whatever. <sighs> oh, look! Look at that! Look at go back! Look. Hey, hey, buddy! You want some human flesh? Oh, that's a really half-hearted kick there. <laughs> Even a zombie can get depressed. <laughs> hmm. Well, that's where the traps lead. So this guy. This guy. Alice Hill. Hold on a sec. Just say hi first. It's, it's rude otherwise. Yeah. Who the hell goes there? Oh. Identify yourself. Goddamn. Thought you might be one of them. You better be more careful. Accidents can happen when you sneak up on a man. Put it there. Uh, I understand I perfectly. like my bones where they are. Man's got to guard his handshake. Gives away a lot of a person's soul. I'm not talking about that palm reading shit. Shake a man's hand, you get a sense of his worth. It's past and present. See the wear on these? Metal working hands. For fixing things up. Or breaking them. Real slow. Uh... No secrets. All in plain sight. Okay. More than you can say for this island. You got the back and the stomach for digging deep. All manner of shit comes out. But nothing I haven't seen the likes of in my line of work. You're thinking there's nothing dangerous about what I do. I don't know what you do. I can tell you all about what people try to hide behind a coat of white paint. Generator's been acting up, which is fine during the day, but at night, they get bolder when the lights are out, the sea beasts. And my aim gets worse. It makes it hard to tell friend from foe. I think it's in everybody's best interest if those runway lights stay on. Did he just threaten to shoot me? I think... I think everything... Yes, holy shit. Everything he said was extremely threatening, and I want to run. Don't run. You're just that tired. God, what is this guy? Okay, just making sure that this isn't just me. This guy creeps you out too, right? I mean, I can certainly understand how he survived the zombie apocalypse. I, I can oh, picture sorry, there's something up here. I can picture him just trying to bite him and breaking all his teeth. He just flex and its head would explode. Our wisdom flow is so sweet, taste and see.
Transmit. Initiate babble signal. Receive. Initiate Carthage frequency. Download. Initiate the Tyrion effect. Price to own. Initiate the Golden Apple grammar. The face had launched a thousand ships. The purple spectrum. Witness. The Phoenicians. Okay, why was that with him? Oh dear. Yeah. You, you don't think the bees know stuff? I think the bees know a lot of things. I mean, but... yeah. Oh wow, because that is some powerful electricity. Yeah, holy shit. Just... Okay, how many volts are going through that? All of them. All of the volts. Oh, right, right, it's amps that matter, not volts. Yes, that is what I meant, because I knew that. Okay, that didn't work the way I planned, but... You survived. Any action you survive was a good choice. I could come up with some counterexamples. You probably could. But that's beside the point. Okay, so let's try the next one. Oh, drug. There's always drug. Did, did it turn off the power? It was looking at that... How does it even know how to do that? I mean, it figured out how to work the Orochi barricades. They're obviously smart. That's true. That's true. I'm not used to not expecting them being that smart. Oh, bicycles. Now, if I could just get this hose down there and turn on the pump with the electricity, that's... Oh, I see a problem here. What? What do you mean? I can't really use the pump if there's no electricity. Oh. Uh... You know, that water does not look good. Whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa! Is that acid in there? That is something. Oh no! It's boiling acid! What's that from? Batman and Robin. No, no, Batman Forever. Batman Forever. So you remember, like, the opening sequence of Security Guard, who is just super intense about everything? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's see here. Maybe this will work. Oh. Okay. You know, I thought about trying to jump between these things, but that doesn't look like it's a real option. No, you're, you're not quite at the Mario level. Oof. Oh my god, that was ridiculous. It feels like my legs are burning off. They, they probably are, but you're just like... Why is that, wait, why is this eating through my clothes? Unstable molecules. <sighs> you, you, you got an explanation? Yeah. Actually, it's because the clothing I use has to be attuned to my anima. I like mine better. Otherwise, it, otherwise I respawn naked. But you know, you know who told me that? Not me. The person who sold me these clothes. Wonder how a, how a clothing vendor knows more than my handler. Um, I, I've heard it both ways. You and Sean Spencer. Ugh. Oh, come on, get out of my way. I am so sick of dealing with these things. Out of my way. Looks like I gotta go around because there's that fence up there. This does not look like a good option. It's fine. I mean, what's. Oh! 
What the hell was that? I don't know. It feels like... It feels like somebody punched my soul in the vat. Okay. Okay. Ew. Okay. What was that? I don't know. I don't... Oh god, that's one of those... those fucking... Yeah. Mega I've seen pods. that sounds rare. But... I don't think I want to go this way. No. This does not look like a good option. I can just... Head on back. I can I go in here. Who has... What is that place? I don't know, but I don't think we want to go there. Alright, here we go. Let's just back to the... Oh, god damn it. Oh, was Scrapyard Edgar down here? No, I don't know. This thing is... It was... kind of soaking up the electricity. Weird. It's probably pretty tasty. I would love to shine a giant ro floodlight on Kingsmith. However, until we get that tech... You'll just need to clarify things one fuse box and generator at a time. As for Ellis Hill, we were to check, and it seems he's new in town. He took the job at the airport a short time before the island started swallowing itself. I'm not saying not to trust him. I'm not. I'm saying not to trust anyone. They sure as hell don't trust you. Chat up. <clears throat> What? Ahem. What? Nothing. Just clear my throat. My my brain throat. Yeah, all that, you know, no trust nobody. Cause nobody trusts me. Good advice, KG. 